Good day, Bonan. Thanks for joining us here in the charts. You're tuned in to the Market Beast Edition. Yes, it is your fellow compadre speaking, of course. And today we'll be exploring the CBAT instrument. CBAT Energy Technology Incorporated. This is a request, special request. Uh, please leave a comment so I can pin your comment. And today we're just I'm going to go over some interesting details that you may want to stick around for if you actually long term investing in this stock. So uh, go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you're new. Leave a comment. The YouTube algorithm is picking up on the channel. Thanks to you guys. We'd like to continue to grow with your help. Uh, we appreciate all of your support. So let's go ahead and dive into the critical levels that I found. Uh, I think this is going to be really interesting, guys. Let's go ahead and dive right into the charts here, shall we? All right, so today is January the 31st, 2021, and the previous close of this is going to be $7.36. It's down approximately 1.2% for the day. Ticker symbol, if you haven't seen it there, C-B-A-T. Okay. So, of course, our infamous lines, I'll go ahead and pull that up. For those of you who, uh, that's it right there. Really simple, actually. Uh, for those of you who are familiar with our infamous lines, will know that uh, these lines have been particularly placed. And the most, one of the most uh, interesting lines is this yellow line here, this resistance line that it actually broke out from ever since 2012. So I'm going to consider everything below the line, the the red line consolidation. I think it's like 3,400 and something days it's been consolidating. If it can break above and stay above this red line. Excuse me, and this red line is going to be at approximately six dollars and ninety-two cents. Okay, yeah, six dollars and ninety-two cents. And obviously, the price action had a uh, red candle above that line. For those of you following me closely, know what we do. Excuse me, on days like this, on a negative day above a support line. Okay, and this is this is very interesting. I want to I want to go ahead and document this right now because. If this is truly an instrument that has been consolidating ever since 2012, you're talking about an eight to nine year bullish consolidation. These moves are very aggressive. So as long as the price can stay above the, what is it, the $6, again, 92 cent level, then it's likely going to go up to this level in a very short period of time, all the way up to about $15.19. Now, this is also an important level because if it can get above and stay above this level, probably have you know a lot of volatility around this level, guys. But if it can actually maintain support at some point in the future, maybe do a little bit of consolidation above the $15.19 level, oh yeah, this price will actually meet the all-time highs. I'll go ahead and document that right now before many others you know finally catch on after the fact, right? Um, and the all-time high is currently at approximately, let's see, so that's going to be $68. Now, before you start hitting that buy button, guys, remember, do your research. I have I have no idea what this, this stock is. It's a very beautiful instrument, but I don't know what it is, guys, so just keep that in mind. I, I don't, like, go off any other data other than technical data, which, again, some will say you don't trust. Like, don't trust me. Seriously, that's fine. I don't trust me. But if we were to do a measurement, if I am somewhat correct about what could take place um, of it, remember, just staying above the red line and getting above the green line. It's really simple, actually. Uh, let's do a measurement to the upside. You're going to be looking at approximately an increase of, let's see, let's just say you bought in about $7.44, and it went all the way up to like $68. That's going to be about an 800%. Let me see, a 68. Yeah, it's like an 800 a percent move to the upside guys so 68 dollars. so that's pretty interesting i know that's really good good news for the bulls if it actually plays out right so that's what i'm seeing it's about like 815 percent approximately i'm so technical guys so that's what i'm seeing uh how long would it take that's that's an interesting part i'm not sure i don't really know how long it would take i remember i just play these by the levels okay first break above the red line that's a critical level and then get above the long term the longevity line the green line yeah off to the sky i mean it's it's really it's all it's i, I don't really know how to time it let's just say within the next three to six months the price actually gets above the first level that it needs to get above it needs to stay above 692 i mean it is above 692 but it's not guaranteed it won't get back below that level right so let's just say over the next three to six months, it actually gets above the green line, fifteen dollars. Then, according to the data, I mean, it'll just it'll take a while. Cause I don't, I'm not sure. I'm timing this stuff. You, hear, you got the targets. That's what to look forward to. Um, again, it's, we're, uh, just keep in mind we're under. Let me do this and just close the video out. 
I got. I feel like I'm always all over the place. Really, seriously. So we're doing. Okay, so this is interesting. And what I just did was I measured the amount of time, like the inception, like all of this right here, like all of that. It actually came out in like 2003, starting out at about, let's see, it was like a dollar and something like right down here. And then it went all the way up to $60. And of course, just from then, it just completely collapsed, right? Let's see, like it came out, just kind of went up, right? Really nice to move to $68. And just from then, just, oof, just really collapsed there, right? A lot of the investors frustrated at this move to the downside. And it uh, just been walking downstairs. And ever since be below the red line, it's actually been consolidating. But the one thing that I want to let you guys know in closing here is the amount of time that it's been consolidating below this red line, assuming that it's going to get above and stay above the red line. It's already above it. Assume it's actually going to break above and stay above the red line. This is like 3,400 and something days of consolidation. And this area right here, I just measured it. It's only about 2,000. Let's measure it once, once more. Yeah, it's about the same, right? It's like two thousand. That's right, three thousand three hundred and eighty-two dollars. So technically speaking, from a very rough estimate, it's been consolidating for longer than it's actually been, you know, doing anything else, right? The length, the most time it's been doing anything has been consolidating below this red line. I know some may say, "Dude, that doesn't make doesn't make any sense," but just watch the price action, guys. You'll see it here in, in due time. Okay, I think at this point, I don't really have to prove that I've make really good calls at this point i know that sounds cocky but it's just i don't really know how to explain this stuff that well guys to be honest with you i do the best i can hopefully you guys can appreciate that but there's only really one level i guess in closing here you need to write down that it needs to stay above in order to play this to the upside six dollars and 92 cents i guess all that could have been summed up into 30 seconds <laughs> so that's it guys take care of yourselves uh, if you if you just join us we also cover the alternative markets bitcoin altcoin so if you're into that subscribe hit the bell we'll send you that information when it is available and that's it. Take care of yourselves. Protect your portfolio. We're going to talk very soon, guys. And bye for now.